Welcome to the Chart Clarity Dashboard tutorial. The Chart Clarity Dashboard is priced at $66 per month, $160 for three months, $320 for six months, or $640 for the whole year. The Chart Clarity Dashboard is only available for rent. This unique rental model allows traders to leverage our products to their full potential at a fraction of the cost. Our indicators are priced at a premium, reflecting years of dedicated development and research in their creation. We firmly believe in our indicators, which is why we regularly upload content to our YouTube channel, demonstrating how our indicators perform in live market conditions. When you purchase our indicators, we encourage you to leave a review and share your feedback or suggestions for improvements on our blog post by clicking the link in the description. Now let's start with the tutorial. The Chart Clarity Dashboard provides clarity in the movement of price for any financial instrument, including currency pairs, cryptocurrencies, equities, commodities, and indices. The Chart Clarity Dashboard pinpoints where price is consolidating, retracing, resisting, or settled in areas of support presently and historically. To begin, click on each time frame to ensure that your broker's data is synchronized across all time frames. Click on Insert, Indicators, Custom, then Chart Clarity Dashboard. Now you can see your settings window. Select Session. This option allows you to observe real-time trading data for the Asia, London and New York session. Start time. You have the option to input the start time for each session based on your time zone and location. The session times should align with your broker's chart times. Last week and four weeks. Provides the option to view data for the previous week and the past four weeks for your chosen trading pair. The update chart setting is currently configured to 5 seconds, which means that the data displayed on your dashboard is delayed by 5 seconds. You have the option to adjust this setting to 1 second if you prefer to see real-time changes in the data displayed. You can keep the remaining settings as default. They will not affect the indicator's performance. Select Asia Session to view the data for the Asia Session for your selected trading pair. Select London Session to view the data for the London Session for your selected trading pair. Select New York Session to view the data for the New York Session for your selected trading pair. I will now adjust the start time of the New York Session by moving the session start time back by two hours. This will allow you to observe the differences in the data. You can switch between the past four weeks and the previous week to conduct chart analysis and view historical data. We will now offer explanations for the significance of the color-coded numerical values. However, if you wish to understand the function of each data point, please refer to our blog post by clicking the link in the description. Blue numerical values mean bullish momentum, which indicates the price is above the open or positive for the corresponding session or time frame. Red numerical values mean bearish momentum, which indicates the price is below the open or negative for the corresponding session or time frame. A minus sign will also appear next to the numerical value. By clicking Save CSV, you will trigger the indicator to save the data displayed on the dashboard as a CSV document. 
This enables you to revert back to the document later for chart analysis, serving as an effective method for chart analysis and collecting historical data for your trading pair. Additionally, the indicator automatically saves a CSV file when you load the indicator or make any changes in the settings. To access the saved CSV documents in Apple Mac OS, click Go on the top right of your drop-down menu. Hold down the Option tab on your keyboard. Select Libraries. Click Application Support Folder. MetaTrader 5 or MetaQuotes Folder. Drive underscore C Folder. Program Files. MetaTrader 5 Folder. MQL 5 Folder. Files. Here you will find all the saved CSV documents named by the trading pair and date saved. Creating a shortcut to the CSV document folder is a convenient step. Simply right-click on the folder, select Make Alias, and then drag and drop the alias to your desktop for easy access. We have intentionally maintained a minimalist interface and design to ensure that users can swiftly process incoming data and make prompt trading decisions when necessary. To determine the most effective interface, we conducted trials with 20 traders, timing their trade executions and the time taken to comprehend the incoming data. Based on the unanimous decision and feedback from the traders, we opted for this minimal design choice, which proved to be the most effective in performance and user satisfaction. This is the end of the tutorial for the Chart Clarity Dashboard. Please check out our blog post by clicking the link in the description. We encourage you to share your feedback and suggestions for improvements on our blog post. Please check out our other indicators by clicking the link in the blog post. We appreciate your interest and don't forget to check out our YouTube channel where we demonstrate our indicators working in live market conditions. Thank you.